<laughs> right, okay, uh, I think the, the chances of this being a nil-nil were, were pretty slim because the, the games we've had recently have been pretty exciting. This was no different, but tough, tough to take, you know, being, a, being on the end of a, a, a loss tonight. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, ultimately we, we didn't defend well enough. Again, we've conceded four goals. The games are always fairly exciting, right? enough with we, Airdrie and it, even if you do thought we are going to go nick the next goal, but then you the park and score, but uh, we're a super strike from a free kick, but ultimately we kind of need to score four or five goals to win a, a football match, and it happened on Saturday as well, we need to score three to win the game, and it, you're not going to do it at this level, it's week in, week out, so we need to look at that um, over the coming weeks, regardless of what we do with that, but... Uh, I guess exciting from a neutral to watch it, yeah. uh, but yeah. not so much fun for, for managers at times within the game. And we score a uh, super goal, Matty, great finish from him, uh, and a really strong win, which was probably a one goal win mm. half time. So we're, we're more than happy at half time to be one all. Uh, but then we just uh, poor start to second half, and next thing we're 3 1 down and we're chasing the game again. But it is fine margins in this game. I mean, the reality is their third goal, mm. massive slice of luck with that one. Um, and then for us to get back in the game, hit the crossbar. I mean, somebody looking at that in the newspaper goes, oh, 4 2, right, okay, we just took a right good beating or whatever. And that's just no really. No, the I case. think we've, we've probably moment. created, I don't know, maybe six to eight really good chances in the game. Rory's had uh, a bundle of chances again, it's just not falling for him. Uh, and Lewis hits the bar, and that's just that's the way football is. But then you just got to make sure the door's closed at the other end, and it's not at this moment in time. So uh, we'll look at that uh, over the coming weeks, as I said. but. Uh, uh, yeah, if we keep creating chances, we will score. There's no doubt about that. We'll, we'll start scoring goals, but uh, we need to do the other side as well. And that does, doesn't include just the defender. We need to defend better as a team from front to back as well. Yeah. I mean, going all the way to Peterhead, I mean, that's it's quite a journey as well. Um, better now than your road. Well, <laughs> <laughs> makes that slightly easier. It's a bit quicker, yeah. Uh, I mean, would you, I take it you would have preferred to have had your next game after that being at home, but not to be? Uh, not to be, no. No, we'll travel. Uh, the guys got off now for Christmas, which is great to get the game played tonight uh, so they can now go and relax and, and have a great Christmas with their, their family and friends because there is bigger things than, than yes. a football match uh, for people. So uh, they've earned it. Go and have a rest. We're, we're right in the mix. We're, we think we're fifth in the league after tonight. So we're right in, the, right in where we'd would expect to be or, or want to be, uh, it's now up to us to kick on for the second half of the season. Yeah, and th that's the thing, the second half of the season is normally, for us, w where we start to become very strong. So to, the, to be in the position we are, if we can continue to, to you know, do that, we should be right in there yeah. at the end of this yeah, season. Yeah, I think we spoke the, the last time that if we'd beat Edinburgh, it would be our best ever points tally yeah. in the first half of the, the first division, which would have taken us over the 30 mark, so we're, we're in and around uh, where we need to be, but there's a lot of good sides in there, as you see here tonight, they're, they're, they're quick on the break and they've got some good players, so it's up to it's up to us now to kick on second half, or usually better second half, fitness levels are good, guys are coming back into the squad, but it's just been one of them seasons, I guess, for a lot of teams' injuries as well, we couldn't train last night due to the fact that six of the guys, six or seven of the guys were off ill, uh, so we just decided to cancel training and try and keep the and the I'm satisfied that the team changed quite a bit tonight, but we've got a great squad, great squad of boys, and I'm sure they'll be, they'll be hurt like, like Walla on that on the back of that tonight. But uh, good Christmas, recharge your batteries, and we'll, we'll see what we can do second half of the season. There, there are certainly pl plenty of positives we can still yeah. take from all that. Oh, we? yeah, yeah, as I say, uh, the two county boys, they go back, uh, Matty and, and Adam. Uh, then we'll just look at uh, Hutchie and, and Valley are here a wee bit longer, maybe for at least another game anyway, and then we'll see when their loan deals are up. But the two ones have been a pleasure to work with. They're a credit to, to Ross County and themselves as players, and they've been a massive part of it. So there'll be a loss. Uh, we might see if we can get them back. We're, we're not sure of that one yet, but they'll, they'll go back. But it's been great to work with them, so that'll obviously open up spaces in the squad as well, and we'll, we'll see what we can do. Sure it's been a great experience for them too. Great. Yeah, they say they've been, I don't know how many Matty scored now, maybe five. Uh, Adam scored a couple and they probably played more minutes than they thought they would play. Yeah. But as I say, they're a credit to, to Malky and, and Ross County Football Club and a credit to themselves. Yeah. They've been great to work with. It's been a lot of good business for us off the pitch, actually. You know, mm -hmm. extension con uh, con contract extensions were a number of players. was a bit quick. Uh, was it? <laughs> <laughs> no, the contracts were a bit quick. <laughs>
Yeah. <laughs> Who's your weird laugh, right? The Shredder's going yeah. as you speak. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, but it is, it is great. The, the, yes, and, of course it is. Steve's, you know, um, interviewed him tonight as well. Of course it is. It's, uh, it, it shows you what the football club's at when you've got Terry Testimonial now, it'll be Paul's this year. Uh, I think Webby's the following year, and then Andy, uh, hopefully, will be after that. So it's great that, that we'll have the continuity within the club, but now we maybe need uh, one or two fresh faces in now just to, to kick us on uh, and give us that competition that we want. Right. Well, look, try to enjoy that turkey. <laughs> <laughs> bit, bit more sauce, bit more cranberry, I'm sure it'll taste lovely. Cheers. Take care of yourself, buddy. Cheers. Very good. Enjoy the